Hi, well I did it. I went down to the stream. I walked down. I used my red poles. You know, those are the Nordic walking sticks. And I walked down to the teepee. And then I hung out in the teepee. Oh, I took all three of these Robertson screwdrivers and found out that it was a star screwdriver, a Phillips, when I got there. Those boards was a shade I created one year because it was so hot sitting down there and I wanted some shade so I just built something tall enough that it would give me some shade. Anyway, it's not necessary anymore and it's it's curved. Mm, the boards are straight but the thing the boards are straight but the poles are curved. Anyway, so I wanted to take it down. And I see that the ice down there is about that thick on the above the stream. There's the layers above in the snow bank in the in the bank, which is snow, there are layers of ice and snow. And so there's this huge layer of ice. Let's put it back here so you can see how big it really is. A big thing of ice and um I think it covers the marsh. I'm not sure exactly, but I think it's up high and it's like that. Anyway, I forgot to... I need to soak some willow. It was really cold out there. It's only near freezing. I, I don't know exactly the temperature, but it was definitely cold. Cold, cold, cold. Too cold for me. Anyway, so I laid down on a piece of plastic and then I... Just listen to the quiet. Nothing was happening. No wind. You couldn't hear the stream from the teepee. And now I'm back. My back hurts now, so I have to lie down. But that'll be fine. And then I'm going to, when I get warm, when my hands feel fine again, in, they hurt in the bones. Really cold out there. It's a terrible temperature. Anyway, um, I shouldn't say that. It's a temperature. A temperature is a temperature. It's not a fever. So, um, just that. Oh. Anyway, um, This this thing is moving up there on the corner, and I, as it turns, it looks like it's bending. But I think it's just bent, and it's held by a little bit of cobweb or something. Anyway, very strange. I have to have a good look at it when I'm closer. Anyway, what was I saying? Probably something very important. Anyway, so I'm going to go do my pottery when my hands warm up. And I will bring you along. Yes, you will. And I should finish um, tying the knots in this thing, which is too far away. The phone is not too far away, though. I could phone for help. Phone for help, and they could get me that. Now, if I had my grasper, which I'm supposed to have, but it went up on the roof and it's now in the kitchen, I could reach it with that. And then there's the oranges that fell down behind Kitty. <sighs> I think this is going to mean I'm going to have to get up. I could put it off for a while. See you later. Bye.